Why is this chickie risky? It's not the crispy skin or the tender meat. It's a nutritional fact number that may make your eyes bug out. Here's why you may want to reconsider eating Cracker Barrel's Southern Fried Chicken. Whether you're stopping for breakfast or a big hearty dinner, Cracker Barrel promises a down-home country-style meal. From buttermilk pancakes and biscuits to country fried steak and pot roast, the chain offers customers a wide variety of comfort food. Of course, Cracker Barrel couldn't bill itself as offering Southern classics without one of the Keystone staples fried chicken. Yet the Southern Fried Chicken is a relatively new menu item. A Cracker Barrel press release touted its addition to the menu in 2019 to celebrate the chain's 50th anniversary. The release boasts, each piece of bone-in Southern Fried Chicken is authentically prepared, double-breaded by hand with a custom blend of three types of black pepper and several seasonings and spices, then fried until it's perfectly crispy on the outside and juicy on the inside. But before you dig into a golden brown thigh or breast, there's something you should probably know. What exactly is in it? No, the chicken isn't made with any grotesque ingredients, but that doesn't mean it's good for you. That's why it tastes so good. According to Cracker Barrel's nutrition guide, the chain's southern fried chicken has 1,640 calories, 100 grams of fat, 475 milligrams of cholesterol, and an extraordinary 4,730 milligrams of sodium. To put that into perspective, the Centers for Disease Control suggests that Americans ingest fewer than 2,300 milligrams of sodium per day. That means Cracker Barrel's Southern Fried Chicken by itself will give you more than twice the recommended amount in one sitting. That doesn't mean Cracker Barrel is trying to sell you sodium bombs or even that you shouldn't have some Southern Fried Chicken every once in a while. Just keep it in moderation. Or you could try something else from the menu. How about breakfast, for example? With a selection of pancakes, French toast, bacon, grits, eggs, biscuits, and plenty of other down-home breakfast items, Cracker Barrel has a pretty impressive morning lineup. But there's one breakfast choice that may leave you feeling full in more ways than one. The Country Boy Breakfast, according to Cracker Barrel, consists of three farm-fresh eggs with grits, fried apples, and hash brown casserole, your choice of country ham, sugar ham, or sirloin steak. It also includes buttermilk biscuits and plenty of gravy. It's a hearty dish to be sure, and it also packs a punch. According to Fast Food Nutrition, One Country Boy Breakfast has 671 calories, 26 grams of total fat, 590 milligrams of cholesterol, 80 grams of carbs, and 740 milligrams of sodium. But the sodium level depends on what type of meat you order. If you order the sirloin steak, for example, an additional 210 milligrams of sodium to the meal. Again, that doesn't mean you need to avoid the country boy breakfast at all costs. But if you enjoy this hearty breakfast, you might consider having a light lunch and dinner. So if the fried chicken is a big wallop of sodium and the steak breakfast option is another salt-heavy choice, how about something that's sure to be healthy? You know what, I think I'll just have a salad. Thank you. Just a salad. Well, Cracker Barrel salads are generally a better option than sugar-cured ham and fried chicken. But even then, approach with a bit of caution. One salad option in particular puts up some big numbers. Cracker Barrel's home-style chicken salad includes either grilled or fried chicken, served atop a bed of greens, tomatoes, cucumbers, Colby cheese, hard-boiled eggs, and your choice of dressing. While this may not sound too offensive, according to Cracker Barrel's nutrition guide, the grilled chicken version of this salad still contains 470 calories, 21 grams of fat, 305 milligrams of cholesterol, and 920 milligrams of sodium. The version with fried chicken nearly or more than doubles the amount of calories, fat, and sodium. Compare that to the house salad, which contains 260 calories, 15 grams of fat, 35 milligrams of cholesterol, and 600 milligrams of sodium. While the amount of sodium, cholesterol, and calories may not make this salad a suitable starter for everyone, it can be a relatively inexpensive lunch if you're not in the mood for any of the heavier items on Cracker Barrel's menu.